ça commence à devenir euh, invivable. France is becoming unlivable, says Patrick Jardin, the father of one of the victims of the 2015 Paris terror attacks. On veut plus d'immigrés ici. On a fait le plein. We don't want any more immigrants. We've already got too many, he says. Il faut les renvoyer chez eux. We should send them back to their homes. On a besoin d'une femme comme elle. We need Le Pen because she'll straighten France out. Jardin knows his views may sound extreme, but before French citizens vote for a new president on Sunday, he agreed to share with us why he's supporting far-right presidential candidate Marine Le Pen. There's nobody else who can save France from the horrible state in which it finds itself, he says. Terrorists killed Patrick's daughter, Nathalie Jardin, on November 13, 2015. She worked as a lighting technician at Paris' Bataclan Concert Hall. Ninety people died there out of the 130 total victims of that night's simultaneous shooting rampages. Jardin sees Le Pen approvingly as France's Donald Trump. He doesn't want terrorism. He doesn't want attacks. If we had somebody like him in France, we wouldn't be bothered. There's no way to know how representative or not Jardin is of the hundreds of French voters who've lost loved ones or been injured in the series of terrorist attacks here in France in the past two years. But for perspective, here in the capital, only about 5% of Parisians voted for Le Pen in the first round of the election. Gregory Reinberg was not among them. He owned the bistro La Belle Equipe, where, in the Paris attacks, 19 people were massacred, among them his wife and the mother of his daughter. In a conversation at his newly opened cafe with Wall Street Journal reporter Nick Kustoff, Reinberg said what Le Pen is offering is counterproductive. In fighting terrorism, he says, There's no magic solution. He plans to vote for her opponent, centrist political neophyte Emmanuel Macron. We asked Reinberg to try to sum up, in English, why he fears a Le Pen victory. With Le Pen, uh, it will be easier for, easier for the terrorists to destroy us. It's what I think 